Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It's Tragic Life here, back with Legend of Zelda Link to the Past, a game that I've always wanted to beat. So I'm looking forward to going deep into this one. Um, go ahead and hit that like button, that subscribe button, and obviously, please, even more importantly than like and subscribe, I know that sounds crazy coming from a guy wanting likes and subscribes, but go ahead and leave me a comment. Um, we're going to continue forward. I didn't let it finish last time, and I got five hearts. Yay. So our next stop is to trade the mushroom. So we got to go backtrack through the village. Oh, I'm rusty on the buttons. I feel like the music's really low. And I did that on purpose because copyrights. This is going to be a big one. The, the Zelda music is so... Like, well-known. It's like the Mario music. All right. Uh, I pushed the wrong button. I'm going to do that a lot. Just be just be aware. Going from this to Final Fantasy IV on a uh, 5 on the Game Boy and then other games that I play on here. I've uh, been doing Symphony of the Night for Twitch as well as the original Far Cry. Me and my wife have been working on Kingdom Hearts 3 and I've been working on Sea of Stars and a couple other games. Symphony, Symphony, Siphon Filthers. <laughs> All right, so... Through the village and return to the sanctuary. Okay. Can I run? Quit hitting button, the button. I can drop bombs. I didn't want to do that. Okay. I think I got my controls. I think I dropped a bomb. My only bomb. Dang. All right. So we're going to go to the sanctuary. <laughs> Which should be right here. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. That's what I get for not paying attention. All right, so we're going to go right two screens. Thank you for the heart. Okay, so this is one. One more. No, I think I went the wrong way. I really do. So I think I... No, I mean, I went the right way. Okay, so go here, then we're going to go down a screen, I think. All right, I got full life. Go down a screen, across a bridge. Okay, so everything's looking good so far. Hey, buddy. That's eh, a crab. I'm sure it's not called a crab in this. No. I did everything right, and then I ran into them. I'll take the arrows. Okay, so I think I'm supposed to go up, actually, if I remember correctly. Uh, back up a screen, yep. Back up a screen. Walk right, and we should come across. Don't hit those guys. Uh... <laughs> Thank you, young man. Come back to the shop later for something good. <laughs> okay, so now that we did that, um, her name is Syrup. Uh, give, we'll give her the mushroom. She tells you to come back later. Walk left. Well, we're out of magic. I think if you hit them, they, they like electrocute you. So we're going to come here, and then we're going to come back this way. Uh, not the button I want to hit. Uh, is it paw? Nope. All right. What kills them? Is it this? Oh, my God. I'm so bad with buttons. Not frozen. Charlie, can I ask you what you're doing? Okay. All right, we'll grab this. All right, so this is supposed to be pretty cool stuff. Um, can be sprinkled on top of enemies um, or other objects, and they can cause some unique things to happen. Uh, it might be worth picking up a blue potion if we have the money. We do. All right. Okay. 
Uh, now that means we're ready to do the dungeon, so... Okay, so how do we get there? Pieces of heart, one of us. Well, there's a couple pieces of heart we can get and an ice rod, but we'll do that later. Um, okay, so... Okay, now I actually need the map. Uh, so that's where we're going. I should have probably already done that, but oh well. We were getting all the goodies. I should have got all the goodies and then ended the video, but I think I was... I had to go to work. I no longer work there, so things have changed a lot. Um, currently, uh, I am an Uber driver now. Uber, Lyft, Instacart, the whole working for myself thing. I'm my own boss again. And my wife, haha, as awesome as she is, she got a, uh, <laughs> ooh, uh, I might not want to say that on here, now that I think about it, because... Just in case any of her co-workers ever jump on here. You never know. Could happen. Probably won't, but it could. Hey, sir, can you drop a heart? Thank you. That was awfully kind of you. Alright. Are you gonna attack me? Don't attack me. Leave me be! No, leave me be! I'm running! Okay. Nope. Man, they run faster than me, kind of. They look like they run faster. They actually don't, which is weird. Their animation looks faster. All right, so. All right, so I think we're going... <sighs> So we're definitely at the right place now. I mean, I just got to get through the door. Ooh, who? Oh, it's you, Don. What can I do for you, young man? The Elder? Oh, no one has seen him since the Wizarding began collecting victims. What Master Sword? Well, I don't remember the details exactly, but... Long ago, a prosperous people known as the Hylia inhabited this land. Legends tell of many treasures that the Hylia hid throughout the land. Bless you, sir. The Master Sword, a mighty blade forged against those with evil hearts, is one of them. People say that now it is sleeping deep in the forest. Do you understand the legend? Yes. Anyway, look for the Elder. There must be someone in the village who knows where he is. You take care now, Dan. Ugh. All right. Uh... So now we're looking for a child. That sounds weird. Uh, ugh. That guy will do the same thing. They're looking for me. Is it you? Hi, Dan. Elder, are you talking about the grandpa? Oh, okay, but don't tell any of the bad people about this. He's hiding in the palace past the castle. I'll mark the slot on your map. Here you are. All right. I knew that was where I was going. Can I hit you? I can't. But maybe. You should, you should leave me be. I am not worth fighting or dying for. All right, so I'm going to try to do the entire cavern. Like, getting there and then beating it and that's where we'll end um it shouldn't be that difficult okay uh, i'm not really sure how to do some of the like the wording of these games so the description might be a little bit different unless i'm doing something specifically i may talk about treasures i get and maybe i'm i'm deciding whether i want to talk about the bad guys i fight because i know i do that with the final fantasy but this game's a little bit different sir that was rude you stabbed me twice. Alright, no heart this time. Wait. I am headed the right way. Alright. Hey, blue guy. 
Can you hand me a heart? I'll take the money too. I have now 50 rupees. No hearts? Ugh. You guys suck. All right. <clears throat> Okay, these are Octoroks. All right, it's gonna be a second. Uh, I'm not chasing them all. I'm getting beat up a bit, so I'm gonna go ahead and get to where we gotta go. The one cool thing about this, this video series, is if I do it correctly, I won't have to edit much. So it will cut down um, a lot, because I'm going to be editing a lot on the Final Fantasy V game, especially since I'm starting to realize I might have been doing things wrong, and I'm going to struggle through that game now. I've been trying to find a guide that tells me uh, when I should level certain classes and stuff in that game, and I'm just, just struggling. It's just been a pain in the butt. So now I'm very weak. All right. I am indeed Sahasrala. The village elder and a descendant of the, of the seven wise men. Oh, really, Dan? I am surprised a young man like you is searching for the sword of evil's bane. Not just anyone can use that weapon. Legend says, says only the hero who has won the three pennants can wield the sword. Do you really want to find it? Mm hmm Good. As a test, can you retrieve the pendant of courage from the East Palace? If you bring it here, I will tell you more of the legends and give you a magic artifact. Now, go forward to the palace. I was really hoping for a bomb, but whatever. Um, okay, so now we're going to go... Okay. okay. It didn't really say anything about that area behind us, so I'm going to assume it's not that important. Uh, I know I can kill this thing. Hey, arrows. I'm picking up... I'm maxed out on arrows. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and... I just let them come to me. We're not We're not going to play with them. It's an Armos. Oh, that's the wrong way. Got it. Got it. Ha, ah, you can't get me. Is he on your throat? You gotta be careful. These guys can hurt you if you're not careful. All right, we're there. Yay. All right, so going in here. All right, we got to lift the pots. Okay. These guys are called popos. Could be po I, I think it's Popo. Honestly, I think that's exactly what it's supposed to be. Um, they're a good source of rupees. This room has a series of balls. Oi. Oi. Ah! Ah! I may didn't make it. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Whoops. Um... Turn to the left and follow the passage up some stairs. Uh, follow the passage up some stairs. Probably, uh, I got it, I got it. Just want to make sure I was going the right way. Across the bridge, across, uh, eventually leading to a treasure chest and things we can throw. Do I need to get him? No, he's Okay. 
Backtrack to the north end of the room and continue up the stairs. A right pathway to the right is completely optional. Wait. It's completely optional and will lead Link to acquiring the dungeon map. I will do that. So we're going to play this like I'm not using a guide. I hate these guys. Style poles, I think these guys are. are. Is that what they are? I think that's what they are. Go in here. Okay, so we can't do anything to hit. All right, I just wanted to double check. All right, are you the map? You're probably the map. Dun, 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 dun. Got the map. Dungeon map, cool. Jump down and go up. Right, everything's dead in here, so I gotta worry about this. <sighs> and now we're gonna continue forward. Quit looking at me. I see you guys. Oh. All right. Okay. So now we. So they're called blue staples. Staples. It's a weird word for me. All right, so we're going to kill them all, because I think we got to kill them to unlock the door. Come here, guys. Come here, gentlemen. Or skeletons, whatever. Almost rhymes. All right, arrows. Yeah, I got to pull arrows. Ah, boomerang works. Well, that's nice. I keep hitting the wrong button, guys. I'm sorry. Can I actually kill them with a boomerang? Or... Oh, I can. Hello. Just takes more hits. It takes more hits to do it that way, which is fine, I guess, because... Oh my god, I keep hitting the wrong button. I promise you, it's not on purpose. Another quick way to do it, just grab one of these and yell. You gotta yell it. You gotta go catch. I completely missed. Let's try again. Catch. Oh my god. Can I get him with the third one? Or is three strikes? All right. That was pretty sad, honestly. Okay, so we have a chest. What are you? A compass. Let's us know where all the treasure is. Well, when you use the map, see? All right, cool. Uh, jump down and go up the stairs. What? I'm I'm looking at the wrong place. Wow. Let me catch back up. Write two screens to get back up to the central chamber. This time on the floor. Um, where we have a pretty bad bad guy. So we're going to go ahead and take care of the staples real quick because they're more of an annoyance than anything. Okay. We actually can't do anything against them, so... Ooh. It says we, we need to just run through the room, so I just did extra work, but I, I, I'm i like that sometimes. All right. Uh... Let's see if I can do this. Yep, you can actually defeat them by throwing some dust on them. Yep. Okay. And they turn into fairies.
Anyone else in here? I do feel like uh, I could have possibly captured a fairy with a a bottle, but I'm not sure. Okay. <sighs> Should be a door with a lock. Got it. Uh, uh, uh. I saw you. Wasn't really worth it, but hey. Hey, we've been here before. I can't do it to him yet. Am I doing the right thing here? I feel like I'm doing something wrong. Yep. Just throw a rock at them. I keep hitting the wrong button. I, I do apologize. Okay, so we're out of magic. Cool. What do we got here? We got the boss key. Or big key, whatever. Um, oh, so that big green guy was uh, uh, Igor. Um, it can take eight sword slashes or... You can throw a pot at it and kill it instantly. Pot is probably your better option. Um, we're going to use this, so... Push this one. Make sure you push the right one. All right, now we can go forward. Uh, what do you say? Dan, it is I, Sahara. I can talk to you tele telepathically when you touch these tiles. Here is a hint. You can use the treasure hidden in this palace to defeat armored foes. Uh, awesome. Um, not really sure how you can talk to us telepathically all of a sudden, but we'll go with it. I mean, it's it's a fantasy game. Why not? We've seen crazier things in other games. I mean, do we really need... Okay, you guys are annoying me. Oh, hello, buddy. You want to play? Come on. I didn't mean to throw it at you, but I'll do it. All right. I won that round, kind of. We can open this now because we have the key. And we get a bow. Yay! Yeah. Oh, you guys are not what I thought you guys were. Uh, I'll look at that in a second. Let's go ahead and take out Big Boy. So what was that that came down? Uh, gray stop will, will drop from the ceiling. Uh, Dodgy's enemy head through the locked door. So we do this. There's a little little thing here. You can go ahead and get some parries. Which I kind of need them. Uh, I have no bottle, so we'll just grab you. All right. Ah, uh, let me try again. I knew you could capture him. I, it's, it's, I'm that rusty. I mean, it's oh. been like 20, 30 years since I've really played this game. Yeah, I am that old. Can I stop hitting that button? I, and then I hit it again and again, because let's just keep hitting the same button. All right, so now we have one. <laughs> he loves his mama. He literally made me <laughs> anyway. Our dog made my wife put a blanket on him so that on her so that he could be comfortable. Which sounds like him. It really does.
Let them come to you. Oh, crud. Trying to save my arrows for the boss. Wake up, sir, and die. Ah, he had a key. Okay, so... Oh, yeah, we'll go through here. I like money. I think most people like money, so money's good. All right, so now that we have the key, we can go ahead and go to the next area. All right. Okay. Um, we're almost done. Okay, so I think that's all I'm doing here. These guys can be a little bit of a pain. Come on. Your turn, bud. Yeah, that just happened. Ah, well, I'm glad I grabbed it, so it's not a, not the end of the world. I'm a better gamer than this, come on. Oh, now we got a heart. Okay, so it's going to be this one, got it. I'm sure if I read, I would know which one it is. All right, we're good, yay. Thank you for the money. I wanted something else, but that's fine. Okay, that one didn't work. Oh, okay, so this is the one that I got to shoot in the eye with the arrow. Got it. All right, that's why it sometimes helps to read, yeah. Heart? Nope. All right. Cannot be hurt by the sword. Awesome. Hit twice with the arrow to kill. This room, uh, rhino room, before the dungeon, there are ten popos. I don't see ten popos. I see a couple popos. Oh, it says tons. I, I'm struggling with reading today, guys. All right. All right. Can you guys? I hit the wrong button. All right. Oh. Okay, so this boss is, is not hard. It's not easy. <clears throat> okay, so the first part, you want to use your arrows.
Takes three of them. I'm out of barrels. That's awesome. Takes a lot more hits with the arrow, but it doesn't make the fight actually any harder. Just keep swinging. All right, we got him. Yay. And we got the... And in a courage, I believe it is. Okay. Um, yeah, pen of courage. And we'll be transported outside of the dungeon. Okay. So um, I think this is probably a good spot to end it. And we'll go ahead and do more on the next video. So until then, uh, you guys are getting a 32-minute video. Adios, amigos.